Now, unfortunately, I can't show you everything that I saw, specifically the engine stress test operating at a full 4K60. So when you look at the 66%, that's all the GPU needed to render a scene of stationary cars. It didn't need any more juice to render a bunch of cars that is, that is not moving. <laughs> you understand? So this screenshot, in my opinion, is very deceiving and it doesn't tell the full story. I can't show you everything that I saw, specifically the engine stress test operating at a full 4K60, specifically the engine stress test operating at a full 4K60, specifically the engine stress test operating at a full 4K60, but we do have this single teaser screenshot, but we do have this single teaser screenshot, but we do have this single teaser screenshot. Just save the bullshit, but I know you still gonna have some dick suckers that still try to say I'm. What's going on, dick suckers? I hope you and your families die of cancer, but that's just a joke, so don't take it seriously. But what I'm gonna talk about today is something that I I I'm just dumbfounded by. I mean, hard eight, really. Th this is what it's coming down to. First of all, I want to say this: I don't care if you have a 1080 Ti. I don't think anybody cares if you have a 1080 Ti. Damage control is damage control. And this, what you did in the last video, is an extreme case of damage control. Now I know the last couple days and the last week you've been flip-flopping, hypocriting, do as I say, not as I do, but right here is where I have to call you out. You're talking about how this is a screenshot. It's only a screenshot. How it's misleading, and yet you failed to realize that our friend Rich here said, stated, and claimed, not only in the video, but in the actual Euro Gamer article, you can read it if you don't believe me, that he saw a live demo running, that he saw a live benchmark running, that he could not show it to us, but he could provide us a screenshot teaser, which is exactly what we've been seeing going around the internet, a screenshot teaser. So why you're making all these erroneous claims about how you can look into the sky and take a screenshot or you can look directly into the ground or this isn't happening or this is happening and this isn't doing and this isn't doing that way, when the man clearly stated he saw a live demo running, well, I, I really don't know what to tell you. You're just sitting up here telling me I'm trying to get into everybody's good graces by praising the Scorpio. Well, clearly you haven't seen me clowning people that have been frauding about the Scorpio, dealer gaming and all the rest of the jabrones out there. But bottom line is this, don't try to deflect from the fact that you completely either ignored, didn't catch it, or lied about this screenshot being non-representative of the actual demo that Rich from Digital Foundry viewed. The same demo he told us that he had a live demonstration of. Now regardless of you having a 1080 Ti, a 1180 Ti, a Titan XXXYZ is completely irrelevant to this damage control, these fabrications you're trying to bring up. So. I'm about 20 minutes into Weapon Wheel 86.5. I have not gotten to any parts of the video where you and Swoob are talking, but I'll get back to it and then later relay my thoughts in today's episode later today.